Make a date with Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Markway at 6 a.m. from Monday to Saturday on Graphic Online via Facebook and YouTube as he expounds on matters of faith. Graphic Online, truth and accuracy every day. Hello, this is Reverend Dr. Ebenezer Marquis of Living Streams International, bringing you matters of faith with Graphic Online. This morning, I'd like to capture my thoughts with the words, Prophets with expiry dates. Prophets with expiry dates. Now, each and every one of us know when we go to the shops, especially the grocery, sometimes you pick up a good and then you would you look at it and say, under it is a best before, and a date will be given for when that particular product would expire or that particular thing that you're buying would, they, after that it's not really safe to to eat it or it's not really safe to have it you know because there's an expiry date on it so it is best before and uh, you know sometimes there are profits that they have expiry dates and it may it may not now, now here, here are my um here are the few things that uh came to me i'm reading the story of and Judas and his betrayal of Jesus. Obviously, Judas betrayed Jesus for profit because he wanted to make something out of it. And uh, he made something out of it. He made some pieces of silver out of it. And the money was given to him. But you know, after a while, Judas got up and said, look, what have I done? I have done the wrong thing. So I have profited from the wrong thing. But you know what? It will expire. And Judas said, you know what? Even if Judas had decided, Judas had decided to take the money and spend it lavishly, buy things, do things, you get it, it will expire. So there are some profits that you make out of wrongdoing that has an expiry date on it. It's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time. It will expire. And then you'll be left with, with the coals of judgment that you have generated as a result of those actions of yours as a result of the things that you did. So you know, sometimes when some things look profitable, mm, think twice. Paul captured is that all things are lawful, but not all things are helpful. So you may profit, but you pay a price tomorrow. You may profit, but there's a price you have to pay tomorrow. There's a price you have to pay tomorrow for it. So it's profit with an expiry date. So Judas got what he wanted, but in the end, he lost it all, and he lost his life too. Whenever we are forced to make, to take certain actions or do certain things that looks profitable, we need to ask ourselves, does this profit have an expiry date? And how long? Because you know, sometimes, sometimes you call it blessings, but the Bible says, doesn't call it blessings though. The Bible says the blessing of the Lord, he doesn't add sorrow. So even though you think it is blessing, there is sorrow in the aftermath. So, it is profit for the now, just for the now. Transient profit, pleasurable profit, but the replications and the price that must be paid tomorrow for it. Mm. Profit with expiry dates. Your choice. See you later.